What's up guys? We're back with another challenge. Unfortunately, my son couldn't handle the jelly bean challenge. It was too much. He doesn't do well with hot stuff. So I brought my wife on and she's gonna be doing this video with me. Uh, these are all we're doing a season 14 hot ones challenge. She's not gonna do it. She's gonna be asking me questions. When the heat gets intense, we're gonna see if I can hold under pressure. So we're gonna give it a shot. But these are all the season 14 hot ones hot sauces. I got them all right here. I can smell them. Stings the nostrils. But we're gonna get into this challenge right after this. guys welcome back to another episode of Lil Mac JTV uh, we're doing another challenge like I said it's gonna be extreme so I hope you're ready cuz I'm not <laughs> <laughs> but these are the ones I have the wings coated in order from this from this way this is least hot to extreme hot so that's the order it goes now as you can see you can see the different colors on the wing, so I'm not a, this isn't no, this isn't a phony challenge, okay? Just trust me, you can smell it. Yeah. But she's going to be asking me questions in this process of the adventure of extreme hotness. So, we're going to start off with the classic. This is the classic hot sauce, level one. We're going to go ahead and give this one a shot, okay? Got my milk ready, just in case I need it. I, I mean, I'm, I'm pretty good with hot stuff, but I can't, I don't underestimate the peppers though, because they can get pretty hot. So, ooh, I can smell the aroma. All right, we're gonna start with the classic. See how it goes. <laughs> it's also done. <laughs> It's actually good. This is good, kind of close to the, uh, close to like classic Louisiana sauce, but with a little okay. more flavor. Mm. I haven't eaten yet, so I've been saving it for this. But I might still be hungry because I might not be able to finish these. So, I'm gonna start with the first question. Okay, you ready? Yeah. All right, so everybody's seen The Office, if you haven't. There's a famous phrase on that show. So, give two examples of the phrase, that's what she said, and make it good. <laughs> uh, like things people say, yeah. and then you follow it up with Let's them. See. You almost, you almost hit me from behind. That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That looks pretty big. That's what she said. <laughs> Too easy. That's easy. But it was good. We're going to go ahead and get the second one because that didn't do nothing. Okay. Second one is going to be the garlic and pepperoncini. This one actually looks pretty good. It has a sweeter, sweeter smell to it. So we're gonna see how this one tastes. Garlic and pepperoncini coming up. It's more tingly than hot. <laughs> oh, this one's good. Good. This one's sweet. It has like a sweet flavor to it. Oh, I like it. It's not hot at all. No hotness? No. Huh. You may survive after all. Hey, it's not over yet. It's not over yet. Alright, you ready for the next question? Yeah, bring it. Bring it. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go and why? Hmm. <laughs> Never thought about it that way. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not really too, like, 
you know, a lot of people are real into like other countries and stuff. I would just, I honestly would go to, it may sound lame, but I, I just want to go to Key West. Me too. Really? Is that your answer? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, Key West, Key West just seems like, because to me, overseas is just kind of extreme. It's a totally different atmosphere. It's a totally different, just everything. And it just don't, it just don't appeal to me. So this may be one of those. There's nothing wrong with that. Maybe one of those weird houses. It doesn't matter anyway, okay? <clears throat> it's my question. Okay, let's get to the third one. This this is where the heat may kind of boost up a little bit. This is gonna be bar Barbados Barbados style hot sauce. Style Barbados. Barbados. <laughs> Can't even read it. I don't know what kind of peppers in it. This is gonna be this bad boy. Okay. So dig in. There's a little heat, still not much. It's not much, but it's there. Mm. It's not bad. That one's actually pretty good. They're all good so far. That one has a little heat on it. You like this? Yeah, there's definitely some heat on that one. But it's not too bad. I'm still okay. <laughs> all right you ready for your question mm -hmm. what's your all-time favorite movie and why and then you're gonna do something else after you say what it is my favorite all-time movie i don't know that's a tough one there's so many good ones well, what just stands but out to you? To right me, now? Well, to me, the one I always seem to go back to that I love, it's a classic to me, is, is Office Space. Okay. Office Space. All right, favorites. now, quote a line that you like from the movie. Ah. Uh, why don't you go by the name of by Mike instead of Michael? No way. Why? Why should I change my name? He's the one who sucks. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> I mean, not, not many people know that line. A lot of people know that line is, sounds like somebody's getting kicked to the Mondays. <laughs> That's a popular one. Yeah, it is. Let's get into the third one, or fourth one. We got us some Hellfire Hot Sauce. Roasted Reaper. That'd be the green one. Let's get into this one. This one's gonna be kind of, it's green. See the speckles. Let's try it. <laughs> I don't. I don't mind food being hot if it has a good flavor. Yeah. If this is hot and just no flavor, hmm, I can't do that. Well, hopefully it'll that one snuck up on you. <laughs> I won't snuck up. This is good. All right. What's the worst concert you've ever been to, and why was it bad? Well, I want to say the worst concert, but the worst band, because the other bands are good, but but the worst band I've seen live was, live was Crossfade. Crossfade was horrible, and the reason why, because they all their songs they played sounded nothing like the radio version. Right, yeah. Nothing like it. I mean, it's one thing to change it up a little bit, but when they were playing their music, I was like, what song is this? I mean, Crossfade's not really a huge band. They're kind of like a one album, one hit wonder type band. And they're one of their famous songs is Cold. I mean, and I, I love their first album, but for some reason when they, when they, uh, when I saw them live, I was excited. When they came on stage, I was like, what the heck is this? It's creeping up. <laughs> <laughs> it's All, right. Up. All right, we're nearly halfway. We got the 
Los Calientes. Hot ones. Los Calientes. Ooh, hot sauce. Ooh, that one's going to chest. Come on, man. There's no one to cheers. That one's sweet. Yeah, that was like... Chicken wings are so good that I'm hungry. Starting to kick in now. It's revving up. But then over. We still have five more. Let's see. Let's see if we can answer the question. What's your favorite all-time band? Not rock. And why? Not rock band. It has to be other. Okay, that's kind of hard because I listen to a lot of them. I mean, mostly rock. Maybe I know. But if there's other stuff you listen to, I've heard you've seen it. Uh, uh. Brain falling, kicking in. Uh, <laughs> I'm trying to think. It could be like any, like Anything. you tell me, R and B, like, rap, whatever, like blues, country. I mean, pop rock, whatever. All you know, that alternative. I'd say like one artist that I, I mean, I would say like besides. Rock, like I really like Post Malone. Okay, uh, good. I like Post Malone because he's different. Okay. Uh, you know, he's he's just an all-around artist. He can do rap. He can do rock. He okay. Can, can you do a small clip of the song? A song that you like from Post Malone. <laughs> all right. <laughs> <laughs> it's true that all that you know is all that you are. You said that it's all that you want and more. <coughs> all right. Awesome. You did it. <laughs> <coughs> all right. We'll move on. All right, man. We got Tears of the Sun, Private Reserve, Caribbean style, Ghost Pepper. Oh, my God. Ghost Pepper. <laughs> Got the little chicken with his mouth on fire. Ooh, instantly hot. Yeah, these, some of these are really sweet. Is that one sweet? Mm-hmm. Not the. That one instantly hot. Yeah. <laughs> yep, that one's hot. All right. In your opinion, which band has the best male vocalist? And why they're your favorite? I mean, that's a hard one. I mean, for me, I being a singer and musician, I like, uh, I mean, Benjamin Burnley from Breaking Benjamin is the one of my favorite artists, singer because of his, uh, <laughs> just because of his style and my style in singing, like, just my influence, I guess. Well, yeah, he's always been a huge. I mean, people are gonna argue. It's just, it's all based on opinion. Yeah, it's just opinion. The type of music that I sing and do. I mean, I can do all kinds of different genres, but Breaking Benjamin, when it comes to actually like writing music, yeah, he's my main influence, and he just has a different voice. But yeah, I like it. I love it. You know, I like it. You I mean, also like Incubus. Uh, Brandon, I think his name's Brandon. I forget his name. Yeah, he's also another. But 
So I had to choose just because the influence would be Benjamin Burnley from Breaking News. Yeah, good choice. I love it. Yeah, I love it too. All right. <laughs> All right, we're gonna move on to Honey Badger. Mm. Y'all haven't seen that movie, uh, Central Intelligence, Honey Badgers. I wanted to get the, the guy they're looking for. It's a good movie. Check it out with Dwayne Johnson and Kevin Hart. All right. Let's do it. Ooh. Yeah, that's good. That doesn't hurt. I'm trying not to drink the milk. <laughs> trying to be. A... You can do it. You can do it. Come on. Trying not to drink the milk, man. Come on. All right. <coughs> Tell me when you're ready. Go ahead. All right. If you had one wish, what would it be? And how do you think it would improve your life if you had the wish come true? Uh. They say a hot sauce can actually give you a high. <laughs> no, it's kind of spacey. It was making me sneeze and I wasn't even next to it earlier. <laughs> uh, one wish. It's hard, right? Yeah, that, that's a pretty hard question. That's why, why I asked you it. I think, <laughs> I think if, uh, I mean, there's many wishes that, you know, we wish, you know, we want to happen but I think of the one wish if had any negative thoughts to be completely taken away from my life you know mm -hmm. because I see my negativity stress plays a huge role in just yeah. your happiness and just getting things done that's awesome yeah I think that's I think, awesome. I mean like that may sound cliche whatever <clears throat> I think that if you could just take the negativity out of your mind I think your situation just everything would be so much better yeah, how you deal with it and everything. Yeah, yeah I totally agree. Because negativity, thinking wrong, thinking just, yeah, just thinking, you know, things aren't going to go well or this day sucks, and just looking at it in such a bad way instead of a positive way, it's kind of hard not to. But just to be able to have that ability, yeah, to say no, I'm not going to let it ruin my day. It's hard, man. It's human nature. Just yeah, human I nature agree. to think negative. I think that's awesome choice <laughs> but uh yeah that's my answer okay i think it's a good let's answer go, let's get to the that's bomb awesome. it's gonna be the bomb it's the one everybody hates it's called the bomb evolution it's the one that's gonna taste nasty and it's gonna be really hot they say this is hotter than all of them i don't know but we haven't got to the last dab that's the best of it's gonna be the, the bomb so let's give it a go Ooh, that's really <laughs> nasty. <laughs> I'm trying not to be clean before the challenge. You're doing it at least. You're <laughs> good. I'm proud of you for trying. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm not to you my lips. Yeah.
get on. What animal do you think is the smartest animal in the world and why? <coughs> Uh, well, uh, getting lightheaded. Oh my god! Getting lightheaded. Are you okay? Yeah, it's just part of the challenge. It's just from the heavy breathing and the. Uh, <laughs> Alright. Well, I mean, from, I think there's. There's many, for one, there's many smart animals. But one particular animal I think that there goes the nose. Uh. One particular animal I think that is going to stand out. It's going to be dolphins. I mean, for one, dolphins, dolphins have a mate. I don't know, it's kind of perverted, but <laughs> I don't know if... <laughs> They say dolphins can enjoy sex the way humans do. Oh, that's awesome. You know, I don't know if, you know, every, it's a little off the subject. We're all human. Wow. Sex is part of life. You know, sex is part of life. They say that dolphins enjoy sex without, I know that. without having to actually mate. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh, my God. And honestly, I mean, a lot of... <laughs> A lot, a lot of species mate because of instinct. Yeah, that's true. But mm -hmm. I think dolphins actually do it out of pleasure. Mm. So I think that the dolphins, all, dolphins may, and not only that, but they're they can be very affectionate with their their species and very. <sighs> <laughs> I feel like even a. What's going on? <laughs> Is this reality, or am I stuck in some kind of? Uh, so you think the dolphins are are the smartest because or the horniest? <laughs> <laughs> well, or both. I think it has a lot to do with. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> it's kind of hard to think. But, I mean, it's kind of hard. It, it, it's kind of a trick question because I think that also. Uh, what do you call it? Those birds that can repeat what you say. They're Carrot, pretty smart. McCalls, They're McCalls. smart. They can repeat you. Yeah, but I'm asking it in your opinion. So I said it's kind of a hard question because no, dolphins every, are very smart. Every animals have their own like unique. Uh, I had this. All right. <laughs> I had this... Smart is why I guess I'm gonna have to go with macaws because they can. You could probably actually have a conversation with a macaw. That's. Mm. What... That's the one species that you can actually have a conversation with. <laughs> <laughs> they they just have... repeat you though. They're yeah, not having but... a conversation with you. Hey. <laughs> Zoo. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Dude, back up, boy. Back up, Zoo. Back up. Good boy. All right. Our dog wants some part of this. Yeah, job. he's stepping on my lighting. You see the lights flickering? Is that you, guy? <laughs> All right. All right, I'm about to say we go with McCall's because okay. they, they can hold a conversation with you and I want to get on to the next wing. And <laughs> I, think that the, I think the dolphins, I don't know. I, I'm going to have to say McCall's. Dolphins are very smart too. They're, yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah, I don't know. It's, it's, it's kind of hard. It's just your opinion. So, it's so yeah, I'm going to say McCall's. I'm going to have to say McCall's because they can, they can repeat what you say. I think, I don't know, it's kind of, it's pretty cool. You know, because the human language is very, the, the dialect of the English language is very, what do you call it? It's complex. Yeah, it's very complex, and, and for an uh, animal to be able to repeat that is very interesting, and very unique, and I think it's cool. <laughs> wow, the endorphins are flowing. All right, so let's get on to this eye of the scorpion hot sauce by heatness. Of course, it's by heatness. All right. Good God. All right. Hideous. Well, you're not a guy, so. <laughs> it's only the taste on that one is nasty. What? 
That has no flavor. Is it straight hot? It's just straight hot. Mm. Sounds terrible. Mm. And those are the worst. Okay. Oh, those are the worst, dude. Like just straight peppery with no. <clears throat> Alright, go ahead. I'm gonna make you work on these, okay? So who's name your favorite rock band? This time can be a rock band. The whole band is as a whole, not just the singer. <clears throat> rock band. Of all time? Yeah, of all time. <clears throat> Well, originally, what got me into rock, when I started playing guitar. I already know. Mudvayne. <laughs> Mudvayne was my go-to. Even though the wrists were hard as heck, Mudvayne is... Okay, that's true. Yeah, I, I already Mud knew. Mudvayne. Mudvayne is what got me into wanting to play music. So now, I want you to sing a small segment from one of your favorite songs. Of all times or by Mudvayne? By Mudvayne. <laughs> what do you mean of all times? Oh. I don't have to, I don't have to tell Wait, you. Wait, is that your band? Yeah. Is that your all time favorite? I'm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have to go with them because they got me into rock. Okay, and I now mean, you gotta sing something. Growing up, yeah, that's I fine. I can't do. You have to, or you fail. Yeah, I don't want you to fail. You can do it. Come on, you uh, can do it. You can do it. Wow, I had those fastest songs. <laughs> <laughs> I made it this far, dude. Don't you can me. do it. Come All right. On. I know it's hard that you picked that band that's just making me laugh. Maybe you guys can sing something from. But you were just singing something last night. You can do it. I'm gonna try. Okay. I have to challenge you. I'm sorry. No. But I'm challenging you. <sighs> All right. When passion's lost and all the trust is gone, way too far for way too long. Nice. Oh, I don't even know the words. <laughs> Guilty of the same things, provoked by the cause. Way too far for way too long. Hold the hand of your best friend. Look into their eyes. Then watch them drift away. Some might say, We've done the wrong things. I can't. I can't even breathe. Yeah, I can't even so do awesome. it. That season. was even more than I expected. Good job. I guess because uh, these hosses got the endorphins going, so I'm like, Ooh. yeah. They really do. Got like it almost. There is like a natural high from these things. Oh yeah. It's weird. Well, you need to take a quick break. <sighs> no. <laughs> Last dab. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm good. <laughs> All right, we got the last dab. The last dab. And everybody knows who watches the show. It's traditional to put one last dab on the wing. So let's go ahead and do a little dab. That's a lot. Yeah, oh my it God. is. It is. Smelling it oh. is clearing out my skin. It is. <laughs> This is a challenge, okay? Let's go ahead and get into it. <coughs> Alright. Oh Last, <laughs> Last one. Last <laughs> one. Let's do it. One, two, three, go. Mm -hmm. 
is instantly hot yeah it's just instantly hot I don't like those you like the creepers I mean uh, all right you have to answer your last question all right let's do it all right who's your favorite favorite actor Favorite actor. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I mean, it depends. Depends on what I'm going to watch. A comedy or whatever. Like your favorite actor, you think that's pretty much, every time you see them, you think they're good in it. Uh, like they're good. You know, it's funny, it's good. I'm going to watch it again. Uh, <laughs> favorite actor. Favorite actor who I like because because of me, I don't know if you know us on my channel, I'm kind of like a, you know, kind of a goofy, like, you know, just off the wall type <laughs> stuff type, sometimes. I, I really like Jim Carrey. Yes, I was hoping you would say that. Jim I Carrey. Knew you were gonna say that. One thing I love about Jim Carrey is, I mean, some people say he's over the top, which he can be, but that's what I love about him. Alright, well, you're gonna do an impression now. <laughs> I'm gonna do a Carrie impression. Oh, I'm gonna love this. Oh, God, I'm so right. glad you said that. Alright. If everyone seems dumb and dumber, I'm gonna do that one. Cause I, I do it a lot. Alright. <laughs> Lovely accent you have there, New Jersey. <laughs> Austria. Austria! <laughs> well, good day, mate. <laughs> Let's put another shrimp on the bobby. <laughs> Let's not. <laughs> oh, good job, you did it. So proud you did it. I, I figured, I knew, I had faith that you could. As you can see, guys, there's some hot sauce residue. <laughs> the challenge is over. I'm feeling a little, feeling a little woozy here, man. Not like I don't feel sick in my stomach. It's just, the endorphins are like, they're playing asteroids in my mind right now. It's cool though. It's good. It's good. <laughs> <laughs> Which one was your favorite of all of them, if you can remember? Flavor wise, Seems like I have to say this one. <clears throat> this one was good. This. Yeah, this was right in the middle. Mm -hmm. Mouse going. I love that little lightheadedness because it's not like a, it's it's not like a kind of like I'm gonna pass out. It's like just, a vertigo. It's kind of no, it's not a vertigo. It's just kind of like a. He's chilling. I don't know. Kind like of you've been smoking the reefer. Hitting the peace pipe. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I've never done it before. No, this one, this one is. Uh, this is the one I like. It has a good flavor, and the kick isn't too bad, but it's pretty good. This one, I think this one's when it really started getting hot. Which one's the worst? Worst tasting? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I, I would have to say people hate the bomb, but I think this one, this one because of it being so instantly hot, this kind of reminds me of a more intense Tabasco. I don't like Tabasco because Tabasco is just instantly hot, and there's no flavor, and it's just like, yeah. bam. Yeah. It's just, yeah, yeah. ugh. Uh, the, the, miss, the last dab, no. That's automatically out of the push. I don't like the last dab. I can see why it's the last dab. That will probably be the last time I use it. <laughs> but anybody who is interested in trying the Hot Ones Challenge, I'll leave the uh, link down below. This is season 14. Overall, the, the flavors are pretty decent. This one's pretty sweet. If you like sweet sauce, this one's going to be go-to. 
But this one right here is good. Could I eat this one? Like, yeah, is this eat. too spicy for me? No, it's, it has no spice. Like, there's no spice whatsoever. You may not even like it, though, because it's a sweet. Mm. It's a sweet pepper. It has, it smells pretty good, though. It doesn't smell bad. But overall, the child wasn't, I, I said I, I can handle hot stuff. It wasn't too bad. I can handle some pretty hot stuff. But it, it, it wasn't too bad, but we're getting mm. off topic. This one smells good. If, you've, if you're interested in trying the, the, the challenge, I'll leave this down below. This is season 14. I'll leave the link down below. I appreciate all the new support. I see all the new subs stepping on board. Thank you so much for that. And say thank you to my lovely wife for coming on board and asking me these questions. You're thank welcome. you for participating. Thanks for having me. There's going to be maybe some, some special guests in the future. You never know. My brother said he may do it. Not sure. So we may be we may be doing this challenge again, but with someone else doing it with me. So it's gonna be a different vibe. But this was a good vibe because yeah, what are you saying? no, it's a good vibe. Okay, it's a good vibe. Thank you for checking this video. Leave your <coughs> leave your likes, comments down below, and be sure to subscribe if you enjoy this content. If you have any other challenges, suggestions on what we should do next, please leave them down below. They are more than welcome, and we appreciate it. And don't forget, to hit up the merch. We've got this little Mac JTV merch. If you're new to the channel and you like the logo, check it out. Save ten percent. Uh, anyways, you guys have a good one. Stay spicy, and we will be coming back to you for more reviews soon. All right, you guys take care.